Fellas, here's something we don't see every day. It is a homemade, what is it? It's a piece of wood, round, and on the flip side, it has five dowels sticking out of it. So, what is it? Actually, you know what? I think I've seen this before. This is actually a job site grooming tool. Seen it, but you haven't used it, obviously. Well, <laughs> keeping your hair neat, you know? But what's really good about it, say you have to go in and speak to a homeowner. You're outside, it's been rainy, and it's muddy. You know, your hair is one thing, but it's the boots. You gotta get the goop wow. out of the boots. Oh, yeah, it works really well. It's a purpose tool. Yeah, you scrape them all off, you get the boots clean, you just touch up one more whoa, time. Whoa, 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 whoa. After the boots, <laughs> Tommy, you got a little. <laughs> you gotta hold it down. Oh, yeah. You're good, you're good. <laughs> no, I think this guy's onto something. You know, this is a very green product. You know, think about what Americans do millions of cups of coffee every day. Yeah. You take that green harvested shade grown coffee oh, yeah. right? and you put it in a paper cup but you cover it with what plastic. <gasps> this plastic lid this thing what 18 half lives mm -hmm. before it rots away in the landfill what's that like nine lives i have no but it's a long time <laughs> i don't know but this is a cover it's made out of babinga wood fits mm -hmm. onto a standard cup 12 mm -hmm. ounce babinga wood that's farmed yeah sustainably <laughs> and so now you can carve your name right here tommy's little cover mm -hmm. right here whatever you want to call it well think of the carbon footprint we've we've definitely reduced it now what also happens is it's a cup holder oh, is that you're cool? on it right now. Is that that's cool? it that's golden i love it <laughs> richard i gotta tell you you are so green <laughs> but you're wrong i know you guys all know who Stuart Little is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That little Minnie Mouse. Not Minnie Mouse, Stuart Little. I, that's what I meant. All his friends need a place to gather, so they sit around a little table. It's a table for mice. Yeah, you've heard of mice of the round table, right? <laughs> oh, no. Oops. Oh. Get out of here. One's more useless than the other. All right, this one actually comes to us. A viewer sent it in, and it comes to us from Charles in Cross Timbers, Missouri. Now, here's the problem that he was trying to solve. You have a random orbit sander, right? Mm -hmm. And on the bottom, you have the holes, and those line up with your sandpaper because you want to actually have all the sawdust get sucked up. Well, see doesn't line up. See how hard that, that is? I mean, you could yeah. fuss it's impossible. Forever. <laughs> so he invented this, and you put the sandpaper on there. And that's so right much easier. <laughs> <laughs> then you take your babinga thingy, and you line it up here with the bottom of the random orbit sander. Voila. Thank you, Charlie. Pretty good.